like and subscribe down below. Today, I want to talk about etiquette and why it's very, 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 very important. If we're going to have a global society, if we're going to have a global society that is going to sustain itself without having mass amounts of violence, we have to spread the concept of etiquette. Now, a very good example of etiquette is Japan, where they have an extreme amount of etiquette. Now, I don't think it should be that extreme where everybody is super introverted, even outdoors, but I think it should be that, but with a little bit more extroversion added to it. So like the ability to talk in public places, but at a normal or like a low volume, depending where you are, instead of not at all, like in Japan or too much, like in other countries. And I think if most people had etiquette, that would mean that most people have sympathy and empathy, which is what you need to keep a, a global amount of violence to a very minimal to zero amount. You know, depending how, depending how a government or number of governments choose to impact their individual countries. And I think one really good impact would be to instill etiquette into everybody across every nation on the planet, on Earth, easily by adding it into the academic system. Now they do do it to a small extent, but I feel like they should do it to a more extreme extent. The more people are able to be aware of themselves and their surroundings in public as far as sympathy, empathy, and of course safety for yourself and others, then you have a society that coexists a lot easier. And then the last thing is that they need to add into the curriculum how people need to build confidence into themselves because a land of people with a lack of confidence, because of a, a, fuck. Because if there's nations of people with lacking confidence and each individual having a severe lack of confidence, it causes a very unstable environment. Because you don't know someone with a very, very high lack of confidence if they're gonna pop. You know, cause people pop once they have some kind of too much pressure on them. You know, if like they're not getting paid enough, if something is going wrong, if someone doesn't have a very stone amount of confidence, some people just crack, you know what I mean? Now, some people will crack to small extents, you know, but some people will crack to very, very large and bad extents. That's why if you were to teach etiquette and a way to, for individuals to teach themselves how to keep confidence and have confidence, then you have a more stable society. Also lastly, I know I said lastly with the confidence part, but also lastly, you have to build in a sense of community. That is, that would need to have heavy involvement from governing officials and people. But I definitely think there needs to be a change as far as like how every nation's government works, you know, because a lot of them outdated, need an update, don't work well now in 2024 when they've been using it forever, you know what I'm saying? So far, I'd say the world has gotten relatively safer due to the fact that the internet exists and we have very, very good amount of communication devices, but we're not at complete safety yet. But if we can instill these pillars, three pillars into society, then we function very well and for a very long time, unless a freak accident happens, you know? Anyways, don't forget to like and subscribe. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys, lucky dudes, on the next video.